the not, the collision yeah. of two cultures because I see it in many other aspects right. of Canadians going to the UK. You know, which mm -hmm. relate how that relationship works. Well, I always wonder whether that was Coles to Newcastle, um, in terms of its attempts. Uh, and someone advised uh, us, David and I, and the producer didn't bite because he was a new producer too, uh, and not an American, not not English, to go out of town and let the play build up his reputation out of town and make a journey towards the West End. And he went kind of directly to the West End and it was, didn't have the cast, he was kind of in the wrong theater, a lot of circumstances, and then September 11th happened. But the actual process of developing and kind of the creating a name for David, creating a name for the show, creating a name for myself, uh, building the show up by taking it outside London mm -hmm. and building it up over time uh, rather than being newbies on, onto the West End. We were all newbies, really. And the, the, the cast had some people who were known, uh, but not known enough. Not an Alan Rickman. Uh, it had le lesser known, known actors, but lesser known, right? That wouldn't carry necessary an audience. So I think the process of producing got in the way. And you have to, when you, s you know, theater's local, right? And you have to uh, go into a country and understand what it's like to do a play in that country and with that audience. And the local producers need to be the ones to take you through that because they know it. They right. And that's where that went ajar. Um, you know, there was talk of that play going to New York, too, and he went to London for the reason he thought we were going to, you know, be this would be more popular subject in London. I think it would have been a more popular subject in New York. Because it would have been like a mystery. It would have been like a world I not. What? Six guys survived an Antarctic thing? Why was it successful here? Because what? I'd never heard of that story. Oh, that's an intriguing story. Oh, I've been taking it. Like, the same process that David caused David to write it. Right. When he heard the story, he went, oh, that's a story. Oh, that intrigues me. And then <clears throat> I think it might have been the wrong way to go um, to go to England. I think it would have been much more interesting to go to New York. You know, it's interesting. When we did Tamara, we went to Los Angeles, a place where they, you know, they had the Mark Taper Forum and they had a couple of uh, 99 seat houses and a couple of little bigger houses. And we went right into, uh, it was a very smart thing on Moses' part to go to LA, not to New York. Uh, because we had to build up a rep in LA and run it for a little period of time before we went to New York and then sort of had some rights or authority to be in New York. It was the right way to go. Uh, uh, so str str the strategy of it was, you know, led to 10 years in LA and three years in New York. That's not too shabby. Thank you, Richard. That was Thank great. Thank you. No, I really enjoyed that. That Me was too. fun.